When I was looking for a college to go to, I was looking for something very affordable and something very convenient close to home. What I found is OUC, which was very affordable in tuition and very close to home actually. It's probably a 20 minute drive for me and I was able to keep my home life experiences and I was able to still able to visit with my family every day but I was I'm still able to come to the Chillicothe campus and get my college life experience. I you know I walk I take the same path to class every day and I don't I see some of the same faces so I start to recognize people so it's very close, intimate settings. It's, it's very convenient and affordable. Go! 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 Yeah, we had, uh, had a couple, about four or five guys going to camps all summer. Been working really hard. So how that. excited are you for the rivalry game? Oh, I'm ready. I've been ready for this for a year. I'm ready to go. Uh, all summer, the kids have been working hard, uh, hard working bunch. They've been dedicated. You know, we've been having 40, 45 to workouts all summer. So that's all you can ask of kids. You know, there's a lot, a lot they could be doing these days, and for when they come out and go through these hot. 90, 100 degree days, um, that's all you can ask. How big is the Waverly rivalry well, for you guys? It's big, you know, it's not trying to hide from it. It's a big game for us, and uh, kids have uh, um, done well the last couple years, and uh, just hope to continue that, but it, it's a big game, and they talk about it, and we got the countdown clock going, so um, expect another good game. Black 10, black 10, set. This has been one of the hardest working teams that we've had. They have put a tremendous winner in. You know, this is one of the strongest group of kids we've had. Uh, you know, they've been agilities and conditioning since January, and, and they've really put a lot of time and believing in what we're they're doing. And so, you know, this is this has been a very good bunch of kids. When you have a great rivalry game like that, very seldom do things get out of, out of hand, and every now and then it does, but that's a rarity. So, in rivalry games. Kids play it right down to the wire, and that's what you expect. And especially when it's early, you know, like last year, the mistakes that we made, the fumbles, the drop mm -hmm. touchdown passes, you know, you just can't do those things and beat a well-coached football team like uh, Tyler Gullion will have. And so you can't make mistakes to beat yourself because they're hard enough to beat on their own. And, yeah. And you can't help them. And, and, and Lord knows that, uh, especially this year, they don't need any help as good as they're going to be. <laughs> okay. Prepared all spring and all summer we were really looking forward to the game and this is big for us I mean if we win this game then that will start our new season you know, as you know last year we started off we won the last two games so we just yeah. keep continuing that make some games to win. How big of a rivalry is it for you with Piketon? I mean it's a big rivalry but I mean all in all we just want to win games regardless if it's Piketon or if it's West or if it's you know whoever we just want to win.